nearly three hundred dollars. Catherine. I heard you. What worries you, Catherine? Suppose I wanted to live in Italy. When? Well, when we get married. You're fooling. No, I mean it. Where did you get such an idea? Well, you're always saying it's so beautiful there with the mountains and the oceans and all of the... Katerina, if I ever brought you home with no money, no business, nothing, they would say Rodolfo is crazy. I'm afraid of Eddie here. We wouldn't live here. Once I'm a citizen, I could work anywhere and I would find better jobs and we would have a house, Catherine. Just tell me something. Would you still want to do it if it turned out we had to go and live in Italy? I mean, just if it turned out that way. This is your or his question. I would like to know, Rodolfo. I, I mean it. No. No. You wouldn't? No. I want you to be my wife. And I want to be a citizen. Tell him that or I will. Yes. And tell him also. And tell yourself, please, that I am not a beggar. And you're not, you're not a horse, a gift, a favor for a poor immigrant. Well, don't get mad. Do you think I'm so desperate? Do you think I would carry on my back the rest of my life a woman I didn't love just to be an American? You think we have no tall buildings in Italy? Electric lights? No white streets, no flags, no automobiles. Only work we don't have. Do you trust me, Catherine? It's only that I... I... He was good to me, Rodolfo. He was always the sweetest guy to me, and I always dreamt that when I got married, he'd be happy at the wedding. And now he's mad and nasty all the time. Just tell him you'd live in Italy. Tell him, and maybe he'd start to trust you a little, see? My little girl. I love you, Rodolfo. I love you. Then why are you afraid? That he'll spank you. Don't laugh at me. I've been here all my life. Every morning when he left for work and when he came back home at night, you think it's so easy to turn around and say to a man that he's nothing to you no more. Katerina, if I take in my hand a little bird and she grows and wishes to fly, but I will not let her out of my hand because I love her so much, is that right for me to do? I'm not saying you must hate him, but anyway you must go. Catherine. Hold me. Catherine. My little girl. <laughs> 